White House guests kneel during national anthem, Trump makes them immediately regret it. The Marine Corps band in their bright red uniforms were on the south balcony of the White House on a bright, sunny Tuesday in Washington, D.C. The Army Chorus sang, beginning the event with America the Beautiful and concluded with God Bless America. At least two people who were guests at President Trump's Celebration of America event yesterday knelt, showing exactly why so many Americans are ticked over the national anthem controversy. The event replaced a celebration at the White House in honor of the Super Bowl win for the Philadelphia Eagles. These two disrespectful idiots took a knee as the Star Spangled Banner rang out across the South Lawn of the White House. Simply disgraceful. These aren't social justice warriors, these are unpatriotic jerks. A video was posted to Twitter by a reporter for SVT, the Swedish national public TV broadcaster. It shows a man, wearing a light blue button-down, kneeling as the national anthem played, before clapping and ultimately coming to his feet after the song finished. I guess he thought that was his five minutes of fame or something. What it really amounted to was making a fool out of himself internationally. President Trump showcases all of these liberal dimwits for what they are. America-hating, radical leftists who are far more interested in hating our brave police officers in our country than they are in respecting America and taking national pride in their country and president. When President Trump took the podium, he blew his audience away with his love for our country, military, police, flag and the national anthem. He made every single person who disrespects them like this look like the small, craven liberals that they really are. The man, who did not identify himself, left the event immediately after the United States Marine Band performed the anthem, according to a news anchor for TV2 Denmark. G, crawling away with his tail.